So the intent of this series of videos is to give you every scrap of information you need to install your own solar panels on a fence or even just to stand them up in the garden. I'll go into details of which ones to buy, which microinverters, which is the best method. Everything will be detailed. The only thing you will need to do is if you're not electrically qualified, you will need an electrician to come and hook it up at the last moment. So what DIY work can we do to try and resolve the problem of high energy costs? Well, solar panels is the obvious answer. Now, you may not feel like climbing up on the roof and installing up there, but putting them on a garden fence is far more simple. Behind that hedge is a garden fence. We've got concrete posts, but it doesn't matter. They could be wood and it's perfect for mounting solar panels. In this case, I'm going to mount them horizontally to leave enough space below so we can put some plants and I'm also going to put wood below so it's going to make it look softer and the the light colored wood will complement the black panels above so behind me is a fence I put up last summer using decking now if you can imagine beautiful black all black panels horizontally across the top and plants flowers growing down below it'll give you an idea of what I plan for the bottom of the garden okay first thing on the agenda which panels should we buy? I've been very impressed by EcoFlow and I really hoped that prices for a bundle would be the answer. I could buy everything in one place. However, at £1,796 for eight panels and the microverters, it's a bit too much. Beware when buying panels. You will get hit with huge delivery costs. I bought some from Trade Sparky and found out at the last moment it was £180 additional. And there's still the case now. And there's a list of the prices being charged by some. So the, the panels can look quite cheap, but when you add on all the extras for uh, delivery, it becomes a very expensive option. Surprisingly, City Plumbing are not charging anything for delivery. And it makes them far and away the best value. So after all this research, what am I going to buy? Well, I'm going to buy 8 DMEG C 455 watt G12 all black solar panels. They cost £68.50 each, including VAT. Importantly, no shipping cost. And I'm also going to buy four off dual in, uh, microinverters from EcoFlow, 2 by 400 watts each. They're £99 each if you buy them from EcoFlow.